I remember how quickly the room filled up. Room 506 was most definitely the party room. And pretty soon the party was alive. Never have I ever. The iconic phrase to set ablaze the ice in the room so that it may break as 30 teenagers learned more about each other. Fingers went down and trust went up. Energy echoed through the tiny room, the boom of our hearts growing less as we relaxed into each other. Never have I ever kissed someone. Some fingers went down and respect went up because in room 506 there was no judgment, no cruelty, no island of misfits, only the minds of 30 genuine humans learning how to understand one another. The admittance of these things cut the strings that society uses to make us dance to its groove, and instead we made our own music. A chorus of Never Have I Ever sent tremors through the room to reverberate in our souls. In room 506, we built a foundation of trust. And once it was there, one by one we began to build not a house, but a home. In room 506, our conch was a water bottle. And the first girl to embrace it, let's face it, she changed us. She told us how important we were, and how recently she started feeling important for the first time. She spoke of her past, and finally rid the cast, because maybe a part of her she thought was broken was just covered too long. In room 506, the boy spoke of how he didn't remember the last thing he said to his best friend, they sent their love with their hands and made a difference in his heart, and the next part of the story came from a girl. She held the conch and spoke of depression. In room 506, she explained that those who are drowning don't want to be told to swim. They just want a way out of it all, and sometimes the thought that the way out is at the bottom crosses their minds. It was the first time she had spoken like that freely. And our eyes filled with tears, but the room filled with love. And it didn't matter where you came from, it didn't matter where you were going, because in that moment, because in room 506, we were all the same. And never have I ever been in such an inspirational group of people. Never have I ever understood the human condition so plainly. Never have I ever felt so strongly that we're all in this together. Never have I ever felt those things until room 506.